Hi everyone, another video to help you with your practicing at home. This time we're going to be looking at Sajo Jurugi Variation 2, uh, so the second exercise that students have to learn and master before attaining their ninth cup yellow stripe. Okay, so this is very similar to Sajo Jurugi Variation 1. Footwork is exactly the same, uh, but we're substituting the outer forearm low block on the turns with a inner forearm middle block. Okay, so here we go. Again, stepping the right leg forwards, walking stance, middle punch, and then turning into a outer forearm, oh, sorry, an inner forearm middle block. Okay, so for here, as the block is prepared, blocking hand comes on the outside uh, with both palms facing away. So both palm, both hands are going to twist into their final position here. Okay, in that end position, on the body nicely half facing a 90 degree bend at the elbow and the hand finishing shoulder height. Okay, so my hand's probably a little bit low here, elbow coming down, a 90 degree bend with the block finishing about shoulder height here. Okay, and then we step forwards and punch, making sure we're getting a nice smooth movement with the foot as we're turning, the leg coming into the point of balance and then back out. Okay. So again, as we turn, nice smooth arcing motion to make sure we get that shoulder width wide as we step backwards. Then we do the same with the left leg, turning to the right here, shoulder height punches, full facing and then half facing on the blocks. And then bringing the left leg back to our ready position when we're done.